What's up, America? I want to share what's on my bucket list. Just like every other human being has a bucket list or things they want to do. And if I don't do anything, anything about all those things, they're gonna be my my regrets when I'm before I die. And that will be my pain. And it will be on me because I choose not to do anything. The one thing I would like to do, I would love to have a, a shop. It's not a it's not, not a mechanic shop, but uh, a shop where people work on cars to upgrade the horsepower. So I don't know what's the name of the shop, uh, what will be the name, or what was the place called, but um, a place where you can bring your car and we can do whatever it needs to increase the horsepower on the horsepower on the engine and uh, have a and have a dyno place on it on the same building. That would be one of my things that I would love to do. And if I don't do it. It's gonna be on me because uh, it's gonna be. I'm gonna start looking for excuses why I never did it, why I never tried it, why I don't even at least look for information to see what it will be needed to get it done. So that will be one of the things that if I don't do it, that's gonna be one of my big regrets. Like the second one in bolts, it has to do with cars too. I would like, I would love to be to do um, I would like to do like a burnout on my uh, on my truck just like burn tires I would love to do that not not every day but just once in a while so I can just get my adrenaline going and I never done it I just do like a small it's not even close to what, what to that but um that would be another one and um, the other one it would be nice if I can uh, learn uh, again cars <laughs> might be really stupid this might be for guys. Uh, I don't know, probably not. There's some women up there. They like to, they like to hit the floor with the gas pedal. So the other one would be like, um, it would be nice to learn how to, how to drift. I never done it. It looks cool on the movies. Uh, I don't know if it's real or it's fake, but it looks good on the, with uh, all the people who do that. It would be nice to learn how to do that. But there's three things right there on my bucket list. And I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do them, but uh, it's up to me. Uh, the other one. Uh, this involves family. I need to talk to my mama, and because um, I have regrets about um, my mom uh, when I was growing up. So I need to talk to my mama. Uh, if I don't talk to my mom, it's gonna be a regret. But I need to talk to her and uh, tell her uh, that I'm sorry about the times that we were um, having hard times. Um, I need to talk to my dad uh, about the same thing. And uh, I don't know if you guys have uh, something like that or not, but I do. It's not something awful or anything like that, but um, I still have my parents. I have zero excuses why I'm waiting for. I have to do it anyway. So that would be two more things that I have on my bucket list. That I'm pretty sure I can get done. I hope so. And um, the, the, the more important ones, family. I have more, but those ones are like the ones, that, the main ones that are on my, on my um, the top of my head. But um, there's more. Going back to the family. I need to apologize to my kids, I need to apologize to my wife, but my big ego or my big uh, pride is not letting me do it. Uh, and I'm seems like I'm weaker than pride. Seems like uh, my pride and my ego, they're like stronger than me. Not for big things or anything like that, just small things that happen uh, on life, but uh, my selfishness is not letting me apologize, but I have to get it done, otherwise it's gonna be another regret. So that's few regrets, the, the few things that I will regret if I don't do anything about it. I will uh, share more, but um, let me know what kind of regrets you have or what kind of, or if you don't have any, but uh, what things will be regret in your life if you don't do anything about it. Right, see you in the next one.